We've created an ape school and this is where the actors come and learn how to be apes. It's, it's a place where they can come in and forget about everything that they've all, ever learned before, <laughs> you know? Forget all their training and all their technique and let everything just go. Oh, animal. That's what they're going for. And just to let it all go and just, you, you, it really is like going back and being a child and just letting everything just go. Oh, let all your training go, let all your thoughts go. Just be direct. <laughs> we started calling it Simeon Academy just because it sounds a little classier than Ape School. And uh, I actually took to it pretty, pretty easily. I think I move a little bit like an ape anyway. I mean, I have, my posture really worked pretty good for an orangutan to begin with because I have a really slumpy posture. Come out right out of it. <laughs> Right. Is there more of the upper echelon? Yeah, the, uh, we have 150 extras that will be involved in each battle. Uh, once we had chosen the people, we looked at, I don't know what it was, six or seven hundred people and came up with our 150. We then set up Ape School here in Ridgecrest and they all came in and we started off at the very basic just like we did with all the actors and wor worked them up to the point where they were moving like apes and then thinking like apes and then running like apes. Mark, what I want to see, I want to see you take off over to here. I want to you see want you to walk slow and then pick it up fast. Yeah, start, you know, yeah, start, okay. start it slow and then pick it up, pick it up, go all the way down this corner and then come back. Okay. All right. <laughs> You're fucking... Come on, let's go. All right, start it slow. Pick it up. Pick it up. There you go. Bring it over this way. Bring it over this way. Yeah. All right, don't go through the glass. Everybody can't. Right, You're up. You're up. You're up. You're up. Come on, Joe. Stand up. Good boy. You ready? Okay. Go on. Get up there. Go on. This is Jonah. And this is the space capsule that they're going to be going into to fly off into space. Good boy, get up there, put your feet down. Good, stay. Chimpanzees are a little bit different than most other animals because they're so socially complicated. Um, everything that you do around them or anyone else does around them has a, um, has a social meaning to it, to them. So. There's a, there's a lot more involved in training a chimpanzee than, say, a dog or something. Um, it's a lot of relationship building, a lot of quality time, um, and it's a lot of work to try to understand their, their little ape heads and what's going on in there. Good. Ready? Put your feet in there. Come on. Put your feet in there. Good. All the way. Good boy. Put your hands in there. Very good. Good boy. So. Here is the chimp's practice spacesuit. Zips up the back. Good, stand up. Good, put your foot in there. Good boy, put it in there. Put it in there, all the way, good. That's good. And these are our practice space boots. Good, okay, stand up. Good, stand up big. Good boy. Good, Jacob, thumb. Give me that thumb. No, pick it up here like this. Thumb, touch it. Good, put your hand down. Good, put your hand down. Good boy. Jacob. So what we've been working on now is having them go up there and getting them used to the capsule closing on them and the seat backing up. And at the same time, trying to get them to do their thumbs up, which they can do, but with the distractions of the bubble, it makes it a little harder. So um, that's what we're practicing on. Good, stay. Good boy, stay. Good, and you can go ahead and close the capsule. Pay attention, put your thumb up. Good, put it up. Up big. Good, put it up, up. Good, hold it, hold it up. Smile, Joe. Jonah, put it up big. Joe, put it up. Jonah, put it up. Good, smile. Good, hold it, hold it. Okay, now. Our new gloves that we just got today. Ready? That's a glove. He hasn't actually tried these on yet, and we may modify the uh, the size and everything. 
These are our first pair to practice with, so put your hand in there. He doesn't understand. Put your hand, good, see? That's a glove. Your fingers go in here. Good. This could take some time, kiddo. One, two, I only feel three. Put them in there. You understand? Thumb goes in there. This is where the real patient starts. Push it, push it. Oh, one missing, two missing. How much videotape you have in that camera? You put your hand in there. Put your hand, good, see? There you go, that's your glove. Jake, chin, hmm, chin, chin, chin. Good, put your hands down. Good, very good. Jake, thumb, thumb. Good one, touch it up here, thumb. Close, chin. Hmm. No, don't chew on your glove, here. Chin. Good, put your hands down. Look here, good, smile. Good, hold it, ah, big smile. Good, all right, you can open it. Good boy. Here you go. Good, stand up, hips, hips. No hips, I know, there you go, good, hips. Very good. Walk, come here, come on, come here. Oh, we have a little refining to do with our space suit. Sweat, come on, come on, that's a good Come on, you got a girl on your tail, you got a girl on your tail. We're basically teaching the actors how to tap into their own ape. <laughs> um, it's, it's interesting because apes are so, really, they're, they're very human. They're very human, and when people usually think about apes, they think about, <laughs> you know, and it's like that sometimes, but most of the time it's real subtle. Things are very subtle, and um, just tapping into each and every actor's own sense of being primal, subtly, is, is really what we're, what we're going for. Pick it up. Like this way. Pick it up. Nice hands in front. There you go, keep moving. Probably Wednesday. We're doing those big tasks. Yeah. I feel like something. That'll look great, though. Okay. That'll look great. Not like that. Right. <laughs> Slightly on PC. Too much. Okay, okay too much. Still, you know, you're okay. <laughs> too much. <laughs> too much, not subtlety. Subtlety out the window. I was sent off to ape school <laughs> and uh, for about four weeks and uh, five weeks. Um, first of all, we had sort of anatomy lessons. Uh, it explained that we had much shorter legs, um, much longer arms, arms that probably had much more, you know, greater length to them. Shoulders that were probably more. I just thought a distribution of weight and power is, is different. You'd have to constantly think you're essentially a quadruped. It, it's hard to walk on two legs. It's hard to walk on two on legs, also that you can't actually. You've got no uh, forward hip movement. So we were taught, like it's sort of a um, bit like dancing. We we're taken through how to stand and walk uh -huh. through like first position. Legs always have to be like parallel, slight squat, killer on your legs, and. And imagine the bit, the image that sort of really worked for me was to imagine as you walk um, a diaper, or I call them nappies, but a diaper full of stuff that you didn't want to spill. And it was that gingerness. And it was that, that definitely worked for me. Um, then you were taught, we were taught how to move. Everything's in rounds, too. Um, uh, possibly because you've got the great length of arm. You're not going to go, nothing's direct. And it's all sort of. Um, a lot of the point, actually, is that it's not, not to in, be intellectualized. You just have to sort of do it. And that was immensely useful because you had to, the whole essence of it was that you had to physicalize everything and think and be in your body, which is completely ape-like. And there's no intellectualization. There's no sort of extra little monologue going on in your head. You had to sort of stop thinking and just try and be present and as alive in the moment, which is all very acting. I mean, it's like, it was like going to drama school. All very appropriate to acting, anyway. All right, let's start with um, let's start with some breathing, just to get. 
really get into the rhythm. So that's one thing that we did find when we were just hanging out with the chimps, is they're just so in tune with themselves, it seems, you know? They just sit and they're just there. That gravity. Completely, completely centered. just centered. Mm -hmm. connected with movement so there is a kind of like how people speak in deaf and dumb mm. somebody is like that much more physical just thinking like how would they talk you've got like different choices either thinking like well anatomically they might be different but unless we are just going to talk like ourselves like this but or then if we talk like ourselves then we can actually connect them like just like how we're being moved we're connected mm -hmm. you're talking about like everyone's they're much more earthed does that mean that therefore we can talk with more deliberation or mm. something? Mm -hmm. uh, or if something's more, if you're, they're more intuitive rather than lingu linguistic, perhaps they are like in sign language, you speak much with much more expression, expression but mm -hmm. you're with more of your body. Mm -hmm. So it is more, or like almost a bit, a bit not dancer like, but there's something Connected. much muscu yeah, muscularity, mm -hmm. but also it's on the breath, but also the, mm. and then the other thing is like anatomically, if they've got bigger ribs, the sounds that they come out with, how the, like the shrieks that when they do go out, then they have to be much larger than, and you know, in between, uh, you've got a whole, it's not like twitches or anything, but it's, punctuated by animal, some animal, useful, it has to be like directed um, gestures or, um, you know, they probably, probably smell something instead of look at something, wouldn't they? Because they sense something's happening. It was taken very seriously. I mean, uh, I, at first, in fact, I failed. I was, I was, I, I was flunked. <laughs> I got F or something. First thing in the movie. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Telling me to do! <laughs> Who do you think you are? <laughs> oh, do it. That living creature! <laughs> This is what I have to deal with. This is what I have to deal with. Stop it! Come around the tree. Come around the tree. And I was told I had ADD and I had absolutely no concentration, which I thought was very chimp-like, you know. But no, not true. Getting her to just focus was the challenge, you know. You, I failed her at ape school in the beginning, you know. So she failed. So she had to come back in and just work on her breathing and just learn how to breathe and just to be. How to be still. And once she found that, it was like, hmm. Hmm. Then her character started to evolve. Once she found that stillness, and she, didn't, she realized that she didn't have to, you know, be on, then whew, her character, her ape, came out. Are they gonna give you muscles in the back? Yeah, I asked for them. So that'll help your neck go forward. Exactly. I asked for them because all the extras oh, get all this help and I don't. They just expect me to act it. No. <laughs> Try to hang on to something, yeah. Hold it. Round arm, remember? Put something over your head. Terry's watching, guys. Keep it going. That's right. Hey, a little heavier hands there. Nice. Keep it going. Hey, Matt. All right. Slow the pace just a little bit on the first one. Guys, we're going to make a left. When we get out into the street, we're going to make a left. We're going to head back down towards the stages, all right? Stay with it. Stay with it. Don't let it go. Stay with it. You in the back. Stay with it. Keep it going right there. There you go. 
Nice. You guys' faces change when you guys get down into this. You're actually, your face is actually changing a little bit. Keep it moving. Traveling as a group. Keep it moving. There you go. Most important thing is just stay abreast. Stay abreast. And also cover down. In the monkey mode. So we can get that tempo down for the march. Get in your mind. Get your muscle memory. Okay, that's good. Oh, that's good. That's gonna work. That's gonna work because another stream coming that behind them. That's good. Yeah. Now go, go. Quick break. Quick break. Quick break. Quick break. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. So we need to get everyone to understand that that the first man, you know, the first man in each squad will be will be handed a weapon by Isaac. Second man in each squad will be handed by Kevin. David will hand the, the last man in each squad the weapon. Okay. We're working on a scene where uh, Tim Roth throws Spade throws a Tim throws Pericles across the room and. Uh, these guys are doing great. Jonah, get over there. Lay down. Lay down. Down. No. 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 Lay down. Good. Come here. Come here. Let me try one. Okay. Come on, Joe. Good. There you go. Good. That's better. Come on. Okay. Yeah. He's determined to take you onto the map, really. Yeah. yeah. Good boy, Joe. Keep your feet down. Get that hand down. <laughs> Pay attention. You're going to get on the pad. Good, Joe. Jonah, get over there. Lay down, lay down, down. That's better. Good, that's good. There you go. That good. was good. That was good. Boy. He's taking you. Keep your hands down. Stay. Good, Jonah. Get over there. Go on, go on, go on. Uh, no, no. Started a hook and no. Down again. No. 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 You don't take him with you. Leave him, Joe. Get up there. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Lay down. Good. There you go. Good. He's still kind of using his leg, though, isn't he? Yeah. Stopping the swing a little. It's okay. He's doing so good. He's doing so good. You get it. Hey. Hey. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Let's try some turns on the breath, okay? Paul Giamatti's amazing. I mean, <laughs> the stuff he comes up with, just, and you see him working too. You see him like right before the scene, he's like, oh, he's gonna do something really good here, you know, because he's always comes up with something fresh, you know, and new. I can't shoot, but I tears on my Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Loose but controlled. Like yeah. just you know, you're still you're still you're not Yeah, freaking out. Right. <laughs> Which is great because now we got it. Now yeah, you got yeah, that. Now we gotta translate that into baby words. Yeah, and then right. we'll start Yeah. No. No. Oh. Okay. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. 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 First baby word is no. 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 Once we started discovering the movement and coming up with things no. and playing no. with all this stuff and eating and and you know scratching and having you know having to walk and quadruped to stand up and say a line is that's even more tricky because then you've got to be you've you you've got to keep all those feelings but deliver a line and. Uh, that was the the turning point, I think, in the in the in the film was when we started speaking. It was like tricky, you know. I want to take it away. Okay, this is the whole scene. Uh huh. I want to take it away over here. Okay. Okay. Take I want that. I want, I want that. <laughs> you don't want me to have it. Okay. Come over here. Okay. Now I've got something you want <laughs> over here. Okay. <laughs> well, I don't want you to take that. You don't want me to take and that. I want that. You want that. Yeah. Okay? Go. Go away. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Come up a bit. Come up a bit. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay. Go. Let's do. Yeah. Go. Tell me what to do. Go. 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 Good. Good. Go. Good. Yeah. Go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Paul, try to try to do something sneaky behind me. Ah. Put him in his place. Yeah. Watch that you get, don't get too, yeah, I don't get low. too, you know, right. crunchy. Right. You want to stay, because otherwise it becomes too, too character-y, mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. know? Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Danger, over here. Danger. Good. Go. Yeah, yeah, good, good. <laughs> <laughs> good, good, good. No. Almost every scene, you know, where there's apes, I had something to do with it, you know, and that makes me feel good. And once they edit this film and, and put it all together, I just hope that the movement looks good. <laughs> I just, I want it to be, I want it to look and, and feel as real as it does right now. I think it will. Kiss. Kisses. Smile. One more kiss. Good kiss.